Hello, I'm Lessa Logan. Today we're doing frogs and circles here on The Reformer. So if you're joining us from the onlineplyesclasses.com flashcard deck of exercises, you'll see this comes after long spine massage. If you're not doing long spine massage, you just skip that and you go right into this. But you, if you come into it from long spine massage, you don't have to do this setup I'm about to show you, okay? Um, so you'll have two heavy springs on. This is not a leg exercise, so make sure your straps aren't too short. If you already have loops on, that's fine. But I want you to see something. When I have my handles on, this is where my, and my strap is tight, my springs are closed. This is where my ring is, right? So this is where my handle is. So my loops are gonna be basically a little longer than that. It's important that this isn't like the most challenging thing. It's a test of your pelvis stability and it, and it helps you connect to your center. So if you have straps like mine, you just put the loop and the handle at the same spot then you take your extension straps you slide them through both the leather loop and the wood handle make sure there's no twists in your leather or twists in your strap and then you put that um, clasp on on the outside so it lines up with the frame i'm going to do the same thing on the other side you could just hook your straps up lie down and put these on i'm going to show you a fancy way to do it though <laughs> so you hook them on now I've got both my straps and I've got my clasp on the outside so they can't hit each other and unclasp while I'm doing the exercise. And then you spock your fingers. I can't actually spock them, but you, you spock them. And then, so two fingers per loop. I lift my arms up, I twirl, I lie down on my back, and then both of my feet are able to go in the straps at the same time. And then there we go. Now I'm in. You're gonna lift your headrest up for this exercise. And then you just go into heel, the other toes apart, frogs. Again, it's not a heavy exercise. It's not about how much I can bend my knees in, but how much can I bend my knees in while my hips are down? So I don't wanna see your pelvis doing that each time. Keep reaching your pelvis long as you do these. And so it really helps you get deep knee hip flexion, but not let the springs pull your hips off. So you gotta control that. After five of those, you go into leg circles five circles each direction and it's tempting to look down at the legs try to look at the ceiling and it's like you're not it's not about doing super stretchy i see big stretchy ones that's not the goal i want you to actually do these fast really work the inner thighs and see if you can keep your pelvis super long okay and your ribs in and everything so if you're doing this well you're going to feel a lot of inner thigh activity and your pelvis and your ribs should not be doing any kind of dances um, it's also a great way to see if you circle together at the center or if you're leaning to one side versus the other side got it so definitely enjoy those they're super fun they're kind of like a way to rinse off before you do the grand finale of the rest of your reformer if you want to feel what that looks like in the flow of a workout go to onlinepliesclasses.com where we do life better